Welcome back to the channel, my name is Brahim and today we're going to be looking at Roblox or Roblox. So if you don't know anything about it, Roblox basically IPO'd last week on March 10th and it's now listed on the Nasdaq. But if you don't know what Roblox is, Roblox is an online game platform and game creation system developed by Roblox Corporation. It allows users to program games and play games with other creative sorry with by other users. So essentially it's quite similar to Minecraft with the aspect of building stuff, but you build games. Um, for the younger generation, this is very popular with them, especially during this pandemic where they've been bored at home and not really doing much but playing video games. So yes, this going on IPO probably now was maybe the best time they could have gone. But now, there's a reason why we're talking about this today, which you've probably already gathered from the title. And the reason we're looking into this, Kathy Woods Arc adds 519,000 shares of newly public Roblox in latest tech bet. So, which ETF did you put it into? Of course, it's going to go into Arc W, which is basically next, gen, you know, um, next generation internet. So, companies with an Arc next gen internet ETF, aka Arc W are focused on and expect to benefit from shifting the basis of technology infrastructure to the cloud, enabling mobile, new and local services such as companies that rely on or benefit from increased use of shared data technology. Infrastructure and services. Internet-based products and services, new payment methods, big data, the internet of things, and social distribution and media. These companies may develop, produce, and enable cloud computing and cybersecurity, e-commerce, big data and artificial intelligence, AI, mobile technology and internet of things, social platforms, blockchain and P2P, which is peer-to-peer -peer lending. Um, ArcW is an actively managed ETF that seeks long-term growth of capital by investing under normal circumstances, primarily at least 80% of its assets in domestic and US exchanges traded foreign equities securities of companies that are relevant to the fund's investment theme of next generation internet. So we're going to look at how much that really is in terms of our portfolio. So as you can see, it's 53 on the list of the ETF. Um, I checked, it's a little bit more, it says 520,742 to be exact. So of course this article did come out on the 11th, today is the 15th, four days later. And what it makes up is half, less than half a percent, 0.49% of the portfolio. Um, market value it's 36,295,717 and 40 cents and the ticker RBLX. So, did you buy this for IPO? Is this a stock you're looking to get into? Just drop your thoughts in the comments. If you enjoyed this video, please do subscribe. I'm trying to get to a thousand subscribers by the end of this year and leave it a like. I'll see you in the next video.